<laughs> what oh. are you compensating for? There's a problem. Yeah. There's a problem you know, because <clears throat> you remember what uh, Mark Bichachi said in the, in the previous episode, episode oh. uh, 13 should be episode 13. Oh. What did he say? He says a man, I asked him a question about a man walking in the briefcase with a million dollars. See? He said there could be no problem that guy would be walking on the streets and he's confident and so on until he meets a man with 10 million dollars. Oh yes. Remember that? Mm-hmm. Yeah. There's always a bigger dog. There's always a bigger dog in the in the fight. Then so, the one million really looks small. <laughs> like he. Actually, by the way, true story. There's a guy who committed suicide. Uh, Wall Street guy, whatever it is, committed suicide because I think he was a billionaire or something like that. The crash happened in 2009. He became a millionaire, as in he dropped some he dropped from the big boys. From big boys. He's still a millionaire, but he killed himself because he's no longer a billionaire. His worth was defined by the title exactly. billionaire. So yeah. it seems to me that results validate worth rather than or should I say our worth begets results. Like, our worth begets results but results should not be the ones that define who you are yeah. as in terms yeah. of, of your worth. Yeah. yeah. Wow. And on that note we are coming back to talk about power, sex, money. The building blocks of a man's self-esteem. Yeah. Cool. Our vision is that through our work, there will be a raising of a movement of godly, solid, covenant men who know themselves, understand their purpose, and are clear about their worth and responsibility to lead the nation's generations, one man to one son, passing on the authentic blueprint of a God kind of man. I just wanna have more than one meal a day If my feeling have some food to spare I just wanna have just a little bit more Not even as much as they Yeah, we're that back. We've been talking about uh, man, a man and his work And we're here with uh, Ronnie Habasa. My name is Lawrence Samali so Boss, mm. power, sex, money I just wanna Why did you decide to talk about power, sex and money? Uh, for two obvious reasons. To what? For, for, for two obvious reasons. He kept mentioning the big boys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That seems to be a trending hashtag. Yes, I think. So now. During the big boys or CDK. You know, big boys. They have the money. Like you're not a big boy if you can't buy a bottle. You're not a big boy if you can't buy a certain car. And if your car can't climb this if you ramp, if, if your car can't <laughs> climb up this ramp, you're not a big boy, bro. <laughs> you know, you're not a big boy if you're staying in Chirika. Mm, uh, come on, it's okay. <laughs> okay. So that's money. So that's money. Then there's power. Then there is there is power. And I ask people this question: power and money, which one has more influence? Which mm. one is able to achieve much more? Mm. And there is a real debate there. And when they are intertwined. Mm. When you see, so you can have power and no money, but make people with money cry, and then people with money can buy power. Now, for who have both, as a man or as anyone, what can they do? It's again going back to impact and legacy. And then sex. We live in a generation where people have convinced themselves and Ronnie as a married man I want to ask you this question and I want you to give us an honest answer can a myself. man be with one woman forever and not cheat because it seems this generation of women has come to believe a woman real told me recently that you know what it's only a stupid woman who thinks that, that this is possible that this is possible for a man to not cheat me, I have given myself allowance. I'm like, you give yourself an allowance for your husband to cheat. Like, yeah. So if it ever happens, I am okay. I am okay. I'm ready. So sex, like, how many women does a man need? It seems not one, two, three, four. Because otherwise, why has the side dish mentality become normal? Someone, polygamy. Someone, polygamy. Uh, we see our pastor is in trouble because of polygamy or bigamy. Your, your pastor? Well, the pastor of the church, Pastor of Jingo, is in trouble because one was not enough, you know? And here no, is a man. He really just attended the party. He yeah. was just. <laughs> <laughs> I see how controversial this, this, this just, I mm. see how controversial this thing is. Mm. So, 
as a man we we see that how, how much money you have how many women you can sleep with and how much power or dominion you wield, you wield around is what makes you a man and and you the second reason to ask to answer your question Lawrence is mm-hmm. our guest has hosted uh different people on his on his platform Power Sex Money and I want you to share with us what have you found Wow. So first of all, just just to correct, <laughs> Power Six Money is in no way my my platform. It's actually a a what total church um, uh, well platform for lack of a better word. And um, why? Because I I, I I mean I've had the privilege to be behind the scenes and why they decide to focus on those three pillars because they, those are actually the three pillars that. Um, uh, move the world. Move the world, so to speak. Yeah, uh, as I was going to use the wrong words and said define all. Yeah, but move the world. Uh, our biggest challenges, uh, solutions, or, or, or whatever, uh, stem from those three. You know, power. Your, your name has power. The names which you mentioned and they open doors. Yeah, yeah? yeah. and uh, it's mm, where the all, name behind G- Gamba yeah, Nogu. Exactly. Yeah. Gamba Nogu. So know? if you are the Nogu, then, uh, yeah. then you are oh. powerful. But Nogu in, in yeah. <laughs> Uh, power everywhere you go. There are power struggles. Yeah. yeah, in in the office, it's it's there are power struggle because everyone wants to be the one who wields power. Yeah, yeah. In, in relationships, there are cut fights. Girls are fight. It's power struggles. Yeah. Who's you know? Mm-hmm. Then money, money. It's all about the money. Show me the money. Everyone is measured by their bank statement. Or you know, uh, if you have money and you are you don't go to fetch water. If you don't have money, you fetch wood and firewood, mm. and you know, happy. Yeah. yeah, and because the ones with money, they take the seat away from. When we go to the village, they say, "Ava, ava, ava, please give the ones of Kampala seats." <laughs> yeah, because there is another. These ones have money. They are so, one. Yeah. Someone made me laugh that at those village functions, the one who doesn't have money tends to be wise. Mm. But when he begins to speak, people are like, ah, you are drunk. You <laughs> sirika, sirika, sirika. Yeah. And then you are poor and listens to you. Yeah. 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 And then sex literally drives everything. Mm. Yeah. The economies, the, um, <clears throat> from advertising, someone, you watch an advert and you don't know what it is until the end. Yeah. Because you can't tell at the advert, is it a cologne? Is it a what? It's all sex stuff. And, mm. you know, uh, these days I see, I, I was in the supermarket. Market and it's just so amazing the brand of drinks um, in the drink section. Yeah, yeah in a high end place, which used to be you know Coca Cola, uh, you know some water or some some minute made now. There's Mukama Nayama. There's who does what? There's manpower for what? There's hey, there's what? Hey, and there are all these drinks and everyone is buying. You know, uh, the adverts rock boom. <laughs> you are rock solid over you are booming. A solid jammer. Oh, you are solid jammer. <laughs> yeah. And Yo. these things are selling, you know. I was in the pharmacy the other day and um uh, I struck a conversation with with a pharmacist and was telling me, you know, uh the male enhancement drugs are what are keeping the business going. Yeah. People are not buying panadol and aspirin. Have you oh, listened to radio? How oh, many ads oh, those guys buy? Eh, yeah. And they're like this thing. This is literally so. Why sex? Because everyone is you are measuring your performance, your ability. How many women can you have? How many what? Eh? So yeah, those 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 three pillars uh, are really what drives the world. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So uh, I don't know as I explained. I forgot your question, but uh, <laughs> the question I, I is just here to justify that no, it's not my platform. I just be we are building. To be we're a talking host about once the, in a while. the building blocks of a man's self esteem, and yeah. we found those three things. Yeah. And I think what we want is to have balance. At the end of the day, a solid jama is a balanced jama. Yeah. Because honestly, you cannot ignore power. I can. You cannot ignore sex. You cannot ignore money as a solid jama. Okay. Yeah. So let's 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 put the power in their hands. And what we're saying, power. those are the three things. If you don't put those in check, yeah, that's where your fault is going to come from. Mm. Those three things. Yeah. What is power? So power is power. You got the power. <laughs> I really don't even know how to define it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I think that if I may use a definition as you think mm. about it. Mm. Uh, Power, someone defined it as 
power is the force to compel action it's ability ability to compel action like i turn up people keep quiet yeah you've seen us before exactly I, i turn up into the home people disappear that's a form of power mm. so let's talk about power i have the power ability to man. change the status quo Mm. I, at my word or at my command mm. uh, <laughs> I can change your life mm. yeah and that's why you hear people who have power or assume they have power even the questions do you know me mm. Mm. if officer I, stops you say do you know me mm. i think anyone who asks that question doesn't know themselves yeah mm. do you know me because it's a thing of do you know who is behind me mm. do you know what i am able to do do you know what i will die at the snap of my fingers you mm. can eh? power and and that's the temptation you even see uh, being given to jesus you know i give you authority over all these kingdoms and what power mm. yeah um but i think as a man you need to be able to put that in check and what is your definition of power um what validates your sense of power you and know what's the purpose of that um and and you know you can be very powerful even in your small eh? but you know Ronnie, he, earlier on when you said uh, the things that move you yeah you said uh, we we deduce that it's when you see someone being pressed yes. whether it's a kid yeah. it's a woman and so on and so forth mm. he, it gets to you so power for me will be a guy who is in a position to abuse but doesn't uses that power actually to uses that power to yeah. to bring people up exactly as in you have the capacity to do something yes. you have the capacity to help and you do something and about you do it. something positive but you see <clears throat> you still have the opportunity and you have the capacity and the force and the strength to even destroy so for me and i'm just picking up from there real power yeah when you really have power power mm. is restraint power is the ability even in a small argument we're arguing about what and i have the ability to put out facts and and just end this argument mm. but i have no need to prove myself mm. and and i let you win you, i let you, you remind me of and the I, I relationships hold, between hold, husband and wife exactly and i hold myself back uh, <laughs> there's a line in the spider-man movie uh with great responsibility comes power eh? great power or is it the other way around mm. you power know comes responsibility aha uh-huh. you know so for me power is to be able to have to be responsible enough to hold yourself but these guys who are cheap and do you know who i am and what i can do hey. powerless people but to have the ability ability mm. to do something and you don't to shut this boy uh, shut this uh, guy who is trying to uh, and change his life forever mm. but to hold back mm. that's power nice. we've seen generals with the uh, sirens and what and traumatizing us and scratching our cars and hey mm. then we have seen some generals mm. following the line mm. big time generals yeah. both of them are generals yeah. but one general is more powerful than the other <laughs> cuz one has the ability to say yeah open up clear man. the way yeah clear yeah. the way yeah uh, but to restrain your power mm. yeah is mm. is you know when you're playing with your kids or your son or whatever of course you're much more powerful than him mm. yeah mm. but as a dad you you allow him to win mm. i <laughs> as a guy who i we had to I had to scold him he was playing matter with his kid but eh, mm-hmm. the guy is so competitive mm. <laughs> big <laughs> joker and just as it say like bro yeah you let the boy win <laughs> And then he caught him so he's like, eh, hey, yeah, but I'm sorry, man. I, think I got carried away. Even the mother was like, hmm. And the boy was, the kid was crying, literally. Because, you know, when power is, I, I have a pick too. You, even the way the kid is holding the cards, you have seen, you can see his next move. But I, I hold back. And I even slide the card, which is going to allow him to add, and yeah. 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 And he celebrates and what, but I know, you know. Yeah. So in the same way, Uh, I think a solid jama whatever power you have power is not in your title you can be CEO but you don't have power mm-hmm. yeah mm-hmm. uh it's it it needs it's it just goes back to the inside mm-hmm. and and your ability to restrain mm-hmm. and to use your power productively mm-hmm. yeah i don't know if that's a lot uh, of it contributes word, big yeah. time yeah it, it contributes big time to 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 your worth you yes. know, if you know what your worth is you don't need to wield it so that you know when you wield power 
it becomes external, something <laughs> external that you're depending on and you to fill it. your work. Exactly. You get. If the king walks into the market, yeah, he doesn't have keep. Sh-